Hello, hello, welcome back. Today I'll be watching season 2, episode 4 of The Sopranos. How are we being introduced to characters that I don't think I'm gonna enjoy whatsoever or I'm not enjoying already? Like Richie, what's he gonna do? He seems so impredictable, but also he's listening to Tony, but will he? Uh, and then Janice. Uh, I don't know, I feel like normally I would say I'm so excited to see where this is gonna go, but with her, I'm so not excited to see where this is gonna go because I feel like with her mom being the way that her mom is and then her already acting up a little bit weird sometimes, I'm just scared about that and Carmela is like fully embracing her and I love that family bond, all of that, but still cautious, <laughs> you know, so we'll see what today is gonna bring. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. Full reactions and edited versions you can find two weeks ahead on Patreon. So if you already want to see episode 5 and 6 edited or full length, you can do that on Patreon. Let's go! Mother, I say, please. I love how they're just gonna watch a movie together, like all these guys. Oh, oh come on. Technical issues. Get that a lot. You know what scene I love most? It was you, Fredo. It was you, Fredo. <laughs> Somebody should tell Paramount Pictures to get their shit together. Yes, and Warner Brothers. What's your favorite scene? When Vito goes back to Sicily. Maybe because I'm going over there, you know? Oh. We're traveling. I was in the Army Signal Corps. What this thing needs is what we call a brogan adjustment. Mm. <laughs> Did that work? Temperatures are expected to drop tomorrow after another scorching day in the city. Right now it's 96 degrees. Did at they say record breaking halt because I don't know Fahrenheit? Get up, up Oh my car. god. Take the car. Oh no, the dog. Let him out. Come on, Churchill. No, don't go. He's gonna come back. Dogs are super smart. Fucking Barry. Barry. Who else? Tony Soprano. <laughs> okay, if my nephew comes in, he's got some questions for the doc, you know, about my hip and all. Of course. Perhaps your nephew can help you with your clothes? Yeah. Hmm. I don't think so. <laughs> Just making yourself comfortable. He's a serious man, Zipatorio. Isn't he like a distant cousin of ours? Yeah, it's so far removed by now. Tonto's a closer cousin to you. We're all cousins, it seems. Going to Italy, huh? Yeah. Nice. I never went. Well, that must sting a bit. It's not over yet. Yet. And we don't get to go. We got school. What about mom? She knows it's a business trip. She's not coming along? Kids not going along. Come, you want me to help with the roast? Right there on the counter. Come, it's a business trip. <sighs> Naples, Ischia, and Capri, and oh, the food. Oh, helping is she? I know last year I said I didn't have time. You didn't. It was football season. <laughs> it's always something, it seems. Are you being straight with me? Oh, pussy! Uh oh. How's it going, Colonel? What a place to get busted. You know where they got the name Dover from? Does it fucking matter? I knew this guy when he had social graces. Oh, yeah, he's not into this convo. The kids are all grown, aren't they, puss? What are you doing here? Picking up some shit for a bachelor party. You know, I'm trying to think. Oh, he's like starting to actually think. Did I ever meet any connected guys from Delaware? The answer is... Nah. No, no, no. You, Mr. Root Cocksucker. See you around, baby. And do you think he's Elvis or what? Yeah, he saw me with you. Come all the way to a fucking party store and still somebody's gonna see you. Sal, listen. That went fine. I don't know though. I feel like he looked like he would be easy swayed, but now I'm not sure. I think he actually noticed. Oh, but Shelly, I love. Na, 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 na. Conte Partiro is on my playlist and repeat. Na, 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 na. Oh, I love this song. Me too, girl. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Angie. Angie. <laughs> what? I've got a happy sales back. Angie. I'm sad and depressed. Thought of killing myself. What? <gasps> Fucking nosy. Eat your money gone. Shut the F up over there. When he did come home that day, I heard the door and then his voice, I'm home. Fucking wanted to vomit. Damn, that's 
intense. Carmela is like, what is going on? Have you reached out to him? <sighs> That's a good one. And her glass is still even full. <laughs> they found a lump under my arm. Oh my god. They biopsied it. I get the results in a couple of days. She has a lot going on. He said, Jesus Christ. Then he went back to do whatever the fuck he was doing. Spraying WD-40 on his pocket knife. Girl. I'm getting a divorce. Is that allowed? Oh my god, I love this song. Of goosebumps. Soviets. Jesus. Oh, I want to travel so bad. You know what I realized on the plane? Even the skanks are worth fucking. Toto ye, what do you call it? The Famina Bello, comma, queen? Hey, you did all right. It's so interesting how they fit right in, right? While they've never been before. It's so strange. I kiss the tunnel. Uh, what is that? Commendatore. Like a command. I like that. That's respect. <laughs> Well, he loves some respect. But also, what is going on? So did you hear? You're talking about the bump in Saros, right? I didn't sleep a wink last night. Oh, everybody's talking about this. She's gonna shit when she hears this. Hey, that's not good friendship. It must be weird that they cannot even understand this conversation. We were hoping Zivatori would be here. Nino is... Uh... Disappointed in your attitude of him. I get that, but also, where's the boss? Nino is happy to be at your disposal. So he's translating bad. And you got contacts in the markets over there. Tom, you try this octopus yet? I'm talking here. You're like a fucking child with the food and the pussy. What's going on here, Paulie? There's a big thing to me, P. I was never over here, okay? Yeah, let the guy enjoy his trip. My price to you? 90 grand. No and me. One nami? So do you feel the road? What do you fucking say? Oh, tension. Stop the toy. Wait, analyze the car. Tesoro mio bello, come stai? Of course, Vittorio scored himself a babe. I am his daughter. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh my god, Mary with assumptions. Embarrassing. Georgia, Washington, huh? Bridge. Right. I feel like he actually wants to say something super important. Tom, you give this guy a golf club, he'll probably try to fuck it. <sighs> okay. All right. And doing drugs together. So that was, ah, uh, the wounds, right? It's kind of like, you know what I'm up to tonight? Oh, I want to join. Manazuka room, this family. And then I should be talking to Manazuka. Manazuka is serving the life sentence. Oh, there's some practical problems there. I will talk on the side to the ear of Annalisa. She is the wife of Manazuka. Oh. Yeah, that was an engagement and a wedding ring. <laughs> Ooh. Sometimes you can have a restaurant and you're like, it really feels nice, the food is good, and then you need to use the restroom and it's so icky that you're like, Ugh. I will as well personally give you a tour of the Comisirisha. She's wearing that dress that looks like the one where everybody's like, is it a golden dress or a blue dress or, a, you know, that one? You should have been guest to our house. I send you the card at nine? Fine. Oh, he's being very close. I gotta take a wicked shit. Can you stop fucking interrupting me? He couldn't go. <laughs> oh my god. At the wheelchair. <laughs> wow, they're rough on him. The kid only got firecrackers on him. <laughs> oh my god. I think Tony's a bit shocked there, and that says a lot because we've seen him do a lot of stuff already as well. Sounds like I'm working too hard. Why don't you take the kids down to the Great Wall and uh, get some Chinese? You know, Tony, don't tell me how to spend my time, all right? If I want the excitement of Chinese food, I don't need your permission. I kind of love what she says because I would feel the same way. You go travel for a business and I stay here, you're going to tell me to, like, make it nice. F you. What do you want me to say to you? Seriously. Oh, my God. Did that just happen? Did you guys see that too? I don't want to be in his dreams anymore. You're having a nightmare. 
I really wonder about this divorce thing. Like, is that something that is accepted? Can she do that in the community? Tony wants us to hang with Nino. Hope we get some spare time. Man. I'm gonna see that fucking volcano. Stop doing drugs, dude. For the volcano might come to you. <laughs> Damn, welcome to my crib. There we go again. He's like, well, her husband is in jail and it's a life sentence. So she's basically available. <laughs> hey. Oh no. Do you remember Angie Bompensero? She's thinking of divorcing him. How the fuck are you? Oh. I don't know them, but yeah, to be married to a man like that. You mean like what? Uh oh. Ah, it is very macho. Try swaggering mama's boy. Fucking hypocrite, shall we? Are we talking about him or about Tony? <laughs> is that how you see your brother? <laughs> what did I just say? And they expect their wives to live like the fucking nuns up at Mount Carmel College. It's not that simple. Madonna whore is a full equation, I believe. Houses. You are talking about me. Yeah. About us. Carmela, no. What is different then? I don't know. That a woman of your intelligence is content to ask so little from life and from herself. Ooh, like she's going there. <sighs> Trying to fan the flames with Richie April of all people? Talk about old school. Richie, because of his life experience in prison, he, he has a sensitivity to the plight of women. Girl, you have lost it. <laughs> oh, Janice, honey. I gotta love you. Richie. <laughs> I felt like she did so well in this conversation because I would be so pissed off. Does your sister-in-law basically trusting your husband and you? Why are we collecting toenails? Or is it to clean them up, right? What is she sending them to prison? <laughs> so, Tony. <sighs> You don't mind me calling you Tony. Tony's just enjoying the view, which is on the other side. A fucking woman, boss. Never happened in the States. Our men kill each other. We're all that's left. <laughs> all my brothers, for example. They all got <gasps> murdered. Oh, no. But our men are in love to their mama, huh? So obeying a woman comes natural, huh? Well, I'll be dipped in shit. She has a good argument. They die or go to prison, so here we are. Well, if an old man carries the respect of the troops, you keep him around. I did something like that myself. <laughs> Super zoom. Oh my god, I want to go. We decided not to travel with a young baby. Like, it's itching. Why do you save your toenail clippings? Why? You want them? <laughs> if your enemy comes into possession of your nail or your hair clippings, they can make the evil on you. Oh. Commendatore. Buongiorno. Ah, stranger. Feels bad that he just wants to belong. Who are you thinking? Pio, you're a star. Pio, two. But you should have shame. Oh. Back up. Take it easy. I'm going to give you one of my best men, and all I get is a bunch of numbers in the air. Ma vera viva. I love how she just starts screaming. I want you to talk to your husband about this. He's never coming back, so you have to fucking deal with me. Up your ass. Okay. Guess that's what he wants. This is interesting. Like, how he needs to deal with this dynamic of like working with a lady. Oh. I just came from the doctor's office. The biopsy came back negative. Yeah, good. I'll be back later. Oh, he's actually really an asshole about this. I was kind of thinking that maybe he just doesn't know how to deal with it. You know, deep feelings. You're scared of losing your partner that you shut down. But no, he's an actual jerk. No, Christopher. Damn, this is so sad. Seeing the activity that you want to do and you're wasting your life away in a dark room, completely zoned out. Pussy! Yeah! You want some coffee? No, I'm good. Come on, it's on the boil. Is he gonna end him? Mm. Oh. Mm. Now you get why he wasn't in the mood to talk, but... <laughs> Jesus. You notice that he's like, his back against the wall and scared and he's just like acting out. What's it like? Working for a woman. In America, you don't have. It's interesting, right? Because he's so like, why what? is your ego not bruised? Wait, and he's like, Tony. oh, you don't have Tony. this? <laughs> we need to finish our business. I said all I'm going to say. He needs to stop resisting because it's not going to change. I fear she might have packed her bags, dude. Oh, so awkward. Oh, 
oh, I'm really starting to get afraid of him. He's like escalating. You see someone in a store and you're like, oh, oh they know, bomb, and they're dead. You take good care of your father. What are you going to do? Send him to a spitz? Oof. Oof. Yeah, who would do that, right, Tony? It's a retirement community. I'll take you back in the morning. Yeah, come on, Jen. She's like, this moment is over. Denied. It was horrible what he did. Might as well have fucking cancer. Oh, mom, don't say that. God gave me more years, Carmela. I won't waste it like I've wasted 24 fucking years with this man. Mm, you know what the church says about divorce. Here it goes. Let the Pope live with him. <laughs> That's a good one. Is this, this is really the example you want to set when your daughter is struggling very hard to keep her new marriage in one piece? Is an example you want to set that you need to be miserable for the rest of your life? And I'm not even saying don't. I'm just saying that at the very least, you got to ask yourself these questions. That's fair, though. But, like, I wouldn't pose them like that. But it's fair that you want her to think. In the end, I know you're not going to leave him. <laughs> I know you won't do that. Oh, this is so difficult. Because, uh, yeah, don't get divorced no matter the situation. Like, she's so miserable for such a long time. The kids are grown up. Come on. It also shows you that Carmela is in it to stay no matter what. I got to hand it to you. Great fruit you got here. Okay, belle fruit day. Huh? Who said you're not a great conversationalist? <laughs> Wait, why would you first use a spray to then light a cigarette? Did I say you should leave? Oh, she loves to be there. <laughs> Some of the guys are Sigilians. Hard headed bastards, am I right? It's crazy how you're like, yeah, I'm that way when it's your grandfather who originally lived somewhere. That's where my grandfather's from. This is how you discover that your cousins. <laughs> the island back there is called Projeda. On heels. The rulers would come from across the ancient world to hear the Sibyl's predictions of their, their future. Their penis drawn on there. <sighs> Got a premonition for me? You're no problem to read. Ooh. You are your own worst enemy. Oh, is that right? Tell you right now, you remind me of somebody from back home. Your girlfriend? Oh, I got one to answer your question. Oh, wow. Cool. Good job. But she's someone you want to fuck. Oh, it's about his mommy, so this is weird. Oh, really? He really needs to get back into therapy. <laughs> you don't want to fuck her? <laughs> you don't want to fuck me? Yeah, I do. Oh, wow, he's direct. But I don't shit where I eat. <laughs> okay, cousin. Don't mix emotions with business, is that it? I don't get why you would speak to someone in a language that they don't understand. 75,000. Okay. Interesting. I wonder if he changed his mind the evening before because it was a bit ego bruised and he was like, yeah, no, now I'm back into focus. What the fuck is Christopher? He's in a dirty free buying a gift for Ray. You found out who got eight great tomatoes in that little bitty can. So far, wasn't he like super sweet to her and also loyal, I think? One of the only ones, but now he was caressing this lady's hair. Here he comes. Hey, come on! Fendi bag. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Yeah, the sides look different here. Oh, I'm home! Oh, this is the situation with Angie. How does she feel? Oh, I have goosebumps. <gasps> wow, I feel like that ending is so good. Because it shows so much in so little time. And we basically also still kind of don't know. He comes home, I'm home. And the moment, like what goes through your mind then? I kind of want to know what went through your mind because it is all saying, right? Of course, you don't want someone to be hurt or dead or all of that. What do you feel when they're actually there? Are you like, yay? Or are you like, <sighs> or worse, right? In Angie's case, interesting. I can imagine that as much as Carmela gives advice to Angie. Her also speaking about her feelings is also going to influence Carmela because you can totally be like, I'm going to be married forever. I'm not going and I'm supportive and all of that. But still, it eats away at you on the inside. What would eat away on me more is the fact that Janice was saying like, you're so intelligent and this is what you chose to do, which is so like 
breeding in a sense as well, because I do feel like Carmela is a really great mom. So yeah, some people might choose to do other things, but I feel like don't diss. Yeah, she might be more dissing on the fact that she well, needs to be submissive to Tony's choices and just living in this life, but with a criminal background. I don't know. There's so much in that. But, ooh, I love that ending scene. I love this episode as well, the whole Naples concept. Interesting how Tony has a feeling of like, yeah, American, ugh, right? They're not same as he used to be. They're not as strong and loyal and all of that. But then he goes to Italy where he does think everybody is. And then it's like, oh, but there's a woman on leadership. That's weird. <laughs> so it's interesting to see these different perspectives. That's why traveling is always interesting, right? Because you learn so much. Love this one. I hope you had a good time as well. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. Commenting helps out these videos a lot. So thank you for taking the time to leave a comment. And if you want to see next directions already, you can find it over on Patreon. This was four, right? So five and six already available on Patreon, edited and full length. Have a lovely rest of your day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.